Thanks for starting a trial with Qualaroo. In this video, we'll show you just how easy it is to create your first survey. Once you begin your trial, the first thing you'll be prompted to do is add the code to your website. If you have the ability to do this yourself, either by editing the source code of your site or adding it via a tag manager, we give you clear instructions on how this is done. If you're not the right person to do this, you can easily enter the email address of someone from your technical team to add it for you, or you can email our support team if you're stuck. It's important to keep in mind that no surveys will appear on your site until the code has been added. If you ever need access to the JavaScript again, you may do so from your dashboard by clicking on the Install or View Code button to the right of your domain name. Now it's time to create your first survey. We start you off with a good template to follow, but you can easily edit the question, answers and answer types, as well as add and remove question screens. If you're stuck on what sort of survey to start with, take a look at our survey templates. These templates come pre-populated with questions and targeting options and can be easily customized. Let's start with a survey that asks site visitors what their intentions for visiting the site are. This template we've got set up looks perfect for that, so let's walk through all the options before we save it. I'll start by naming my survey, which I can do up here at the top. Then I'll begin work on the initial screen people see when my survey comes up. I want to ask a write-in question, but I also want to make sure my survey is easy to engage with, so I'm going to ask a question that can be responded to with a simple yes or no. I'll set up some branching logic so survey takers will see the writing question next. I'm also going to mark my write-in as required so I don't get blanks in my reporting. This looks perfect! Let's save our changes. Now I need to make sure the most appropriate audience sees my survey, and I do that with the targeting section. Targeting is broken down into four areas. Where focuses on the portion of your website that has the ability to fire the survey. I want this survey to come up anywhere on my website, so I'll type in my domain and add a wildcard at the end. The Who section focuses on the specifics of the people who visit those pages. In this section, I can choose to only focus on referring traffic from outside sources, which is a great way to only focus on survey visitors that come to landing pages. I can also set it up to fire after someone visits two pages on my website. The When section focuses on visitor activities at the page level. I only want people who are about to leave my site to see this survey, so I'm going to check the Page Abandonment option. Finally, How allows me to indicate how often visitors will see this specific survey. I'm going to select Continue Showing Until They've Responded. This looks great. I'm going to save my changes and move on to designing the look and feel of my survey. Here, I can make the survey look a little bit more like my brand. I can use the color picker to change the background, the text, the look and feel of the buttons, and I can even upload my own logo. There, that looks perfect. Now we're ready to push this to my website. From your dashboard, just click on the gray pause button to switch it to enable. Within seconds, my survey is live on my website. Do keep in mind there is a two hour delay between when the survey starts collecting impressions and responses and that information showing up on your dashboard. We hope that this video has helped to answer some of the questions that you may have had about getting started, but if you still need assistance, please reach out to the customer success team. We can help you with anything from why your survey may not be showing up to giving you personalized best practice advice. We can be reached via email at support at .com, or you can give us a call. Our phone number is 1-650-450-4938. Thanks and happy surveying!